I am Anil Kumar sharing with you a question from my subscriber. Let me thank all the subscribers and viewers for taking keen interest in my channel and posting excellent questions. Now he wants to know how to find n if nc4 equals to 210. So what we are given here is that nc4 is equal to 210. We need to find n and that too we should be in a position to find without calculator. So I'll show you a technique of doing it. Let us first understand what NCR is. In general, the formula for NCR is N factorial divided by R factorial times N minus R factorial. So in that case, I could write nc4 as n factorial divided by 4 factorial times n minus 4 factorial. Now we are given nc4 as equal to 210. So let me write down 210 here. So we get 210 equals to, now what is n factorial? n factorial means n times n minus 1 times n minus 2, times n minus 3, times n minus 4. Since we have n minus 4 factorial in the denominator, we can stop right there. And in the denominator, we have 4 factorial, which is basically 4 times 3, times 2 times 1, times n minus 4 factorial. Now, we can cancel n minus 4 factorial, right? So we have slightly simpler version, 210 equals to n times n minus 1 times n minus 2 times n minus 3. So these are four numbers which when multiplied should give you 210 and the denominator here is 4 times 3, 12 times 2, 20, uh, 24, right? 24. So that's what it is. If you look at this equation where we need to solve for n, we could actually write this as product of four numbers, n times n minus 1 times n minus 2 times n minus 3 as equal to 210 times 24, right? That is what we need. So if you think about it, we're looking for product of four consecutive numbers. Equal to 210 times 24, correct? That is what the sum is, correct? So that is what we are looking for. We are looking for a product of four consecutive numbers. These are four consecutive numbers in a sequence which should result into 210 times 24. Now I have a neat solution to this. Let me write factors for these, right? Now 210 could be written as 10 times 21, correct? 10 times 21. Uh, 24 could be written as 8 times 3. 8 times 3 is 24. Okay, now we could further divide 21 into its factors, which are 7 and 3. Now, if you look at it, you can see four numbers. Combining 3 and 3, 3 times 3 is 9. Do you see that? 3 times 3 is 9. So, we have four numbers, which will result into 210 times 24. Does it make sense? So we could write this as 7 times 8 times 9 times 10 should be equal to 210 times 24, right? So if you compare, what do you get? We get 10 as n, right? So you could write this as 10 times 10 minus 1, which is 9, 10 minus 2, which is 8, 
and 10 minus 3 which is 7 do you see that so that from comparison let's now compare it the number 10 here matches with n right so we can say n is equal to 10 perfect so that concludes that 10 c4 should be equal to 210 right so that is how we can actually solve it even without a calculator no calculations required let us verify using the calculator do we get the same result or not right so here is 10 shift combination 4 is equal to 210 right clearly 210 so that is how we could do it so i hope the steps are absolutely clear feel free to write your comments and share your views and if you like and subscribe to my videos that will be great thanks a lot for the question and all the best.